Hi, today we're unboxing the new structure decks from Yu-Gi-Oh! Official card game, the Asia English edition. And we had the first two structure deck for the re um, revamped version of the Asia English. We have Black Magician or Dark Magician in the English version and Blue Eye White Dragon, the two most iconic characters right, in the Yu-Gi-Oh! series. Alright, so if you have not watched the unboxing of the um, speed start deck. Let's take a small little explanation of what are the difference between the English edition, Asia English edition, and other version. All right. So, in my hand now, I have three different version of cards. Number one, OCG Japanese, Black Magician. Number two, the O Asia English, Dark Magician. And over here is the Yu-Gi-Oh! training card game, the English one, which is sold in the United States and also Europe. Alright, so the main difference, first of all, um, other than the printing and the, you'll be the logo at the back. Right, so this will be the logo for the normal OCG Japanese and also the new Asia English. Next, we have the official logo for the OCG, O Asia English, right? This is the O version, and of course we have the TCG, which is which have a totally different logo, right? So, for the Asia English version, it will be a totally um, same cut back, and allows you to mix them together. And also, according to the website, there will be future Asia English only. Um, tournaments right so I don't think you'll hurt to collect the Asian English too and this will also help um, to build the community as I don't have any decks in front of me the thing about the current Yu-Gi-Oh will be the text is so long right? it's so um, nonsensically long that um <laughs> Unless you memorize or you have a translating device next to you, it's almost impossible to for you to read. I right, found one in front of me. So this is a OCG card. So as you can see, the text is like you know so long, like here. And having an English version will really really help for um the game to build new players, like what they did in twenty. I believe it's 2003, 2004, or 2001, right? So it's that long ago until like 2015, right? Which was, the, it was back then, it was the boom. So right now that is finally back. Let's hope that uh, we can bring in more players back to this game. Right. Anyway, this is one of the few games that actually bring the Japanese card game um culture outside Japan. Right? This is one of the biggest uh, contributor to the current card game um, scene we have. All right, Magic may be the one that bring in the hype, but this was the first game that actually bring in the cool element to worldwide. And almost every kid back then knows about this card game. All right, let's take a look at the packaging. So it's similar to the um, normal Japanese OCG with the structure na name here. We have the card list. Alright, so there's 42 cards including the extra deck uh, which makes like one copy of everything. And each deck, alright, each deck comes with a power bar pack with 5 random cards out of the 25 here. Alright, so there's an official app, Neuron, which allows you to keep your deck list use it as a calculator for calculating of life and also to translate Japanese cards right what you need to do is just to get your phone with the app it's not on this phone right actually this phone just died like two days ago <laughs> so with the app you can just put your cards at the bottom um, scan it using the camera and you also you auto translate which is very very helpful And this is the blue eye, exactly the same. Alright, let's take a look at the black magician or dark magician. Alright, 
and or the thing that I'm most curious will be are there foils? Right. Are there foils in this deck? The deck is around as around twenty dollars. Right, it's average around twenty dollar. Make it uh, almost the same price as your average structure deck. Oh we do have voice. Alright, so the content we have the power pack here. Five cards. This is a uh, I believe it's a paper play mat. Oh. So we have black magician, dark magician one side and blue eye white dragon at the other side. At the back will be the generic play mat with other zones. I believe this is more of a poster than a play mat, I believe. Right. Next will be the main, which will be the structure deck itself. So 42 cards including extra deck. Let's see, we have Dimension Foy. Oh, Dimension Girl is also Foy. And it's uncensored if you know which part is censored. Next, Magician of Dark Illusion. Magician's Road. Rod and one funny thing would be right, so this is a rope and the rod for Dark Magician. So if you were to add the power together, right, you'll learn that actually Dark Magician without the armor, without the clothing and the rod, um, it's zero defense and no 200 power. <laughs> All right, and let's continue. Oh, Apprentice Illusion Magician. I believe this was a promo. The Japanese version. Oh, Magic Kuribo. Dimension Conjurer. Jester Conflict. Sun Gun. Oh, Wish of Black Forest. Legion the Fin Jester. Oh, Kaiku was reprinted. Breaker. Summoner Monk. Spellbook Magician of Prophecy. Armageddon Knight, Keeper of Dragon Magic, Mana Dragon, oh, Magical Dimension, used to be my favorite card, Dark Magician, Magical Circle, Illusion Magic, Dark Magic Expanded, Dark Magic Inheritance, Soul Servant, Secret Dimension, oh, Monster Reborn, which is the Japanese art version, Polymerize, Secret Village of Spellcaster, Wonder Wand, Fusion Substitute, Spellbook Secret, Spellbook Knowledge, Fusion Deployment. Oh, Eternal Soul will be for you too. Magician's Navigation, Magician's Combination, Solemn Judgment, Magic Cylinder, Amulet Dragon, and oh, Dark Magician, the Dragon Knight will also be in for you. Alright, put it aside and let's take a look at the power up pack. So each power up pack have five cards. They are random and there's a total of 25 types. And this kind of pack was designed so that you can't do this, right? It will damage the cards. So the best way of using a scissors to cut it like this, but since I do not have it with me right now, I will this small little slit here. Alright, so when you open this kind of slit, just make sure you open it sideways like this and carefully pull it apart once there's a gap it's very easy to open so that you will not like, damage the cards all right so in the pack we have dd crow right this was this is very secret i can't tell mira force right key right thousand knives and dark renewal oh this is actually better than expected Right, since we are done with Dark Magician, let's take a look at everybody's favorite Blue Eye White Dragon. Alright, actually earlier this month I was trying to get um, a whole of the structure deck for Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon for the game Rush Duel. <laughs> right, and oh, it was so everywhere. Alright, it was so everywhere. Right, that's how popular um, this Blue Eye White Dragon. 
Alright, so let's see, this should be the, exactly the same, other than the back will be in blue instead of purple. Alright, it's exactly the same, let's not waste our time. Alright, so for the power pack for blue eyes is slightly, I believe it's different. Actually, is it the same? Let's take a look at the list. Yeah, it's different, it's totally different. Alright, since it's totally different, let's put this aside first. And take a look at the structure deck itself. So we have Foy Blue Eye White Dragon. I believe this art was um, released during the anniversary. One of, one of the anniversary. It's in another structure. It was from another structure deck in common. So it will be um, Blue Eyes and Dark Magician coming up on the tablet. Elaborated Dragon, Alexandrite Dragon, Flame View Card, Maiden with Eye of Blue is Foy, alright, Protector with Eye of Blue, alright, all the Eye of Blue support, Rider of Storm Winds, Keeper of the Shrine, oh, White Stone Legend, uh, Key Card for Blue Eye White Dragon, White Stone of Ancient, oh, Kai Barman, alright, this should be, used to be very, very expensive because it was a game promo. Dictator of D, this was of premium pack, I believe. Hardened Arm Dragon, Heretic Dragon of Noon, Omni Dragon, Chaos Dragon, the Oak Honors, Harbonedon, Dragon Shine, Silver Sky, Blue, Burst Stream of Destruction, Majesty Rise of Blue, Vision with Eye of Blue, Mercenary of White, Beacon of White, Melody Awakening, Terraforming, Trade In, Cuts. One for one. This is a very very useful card, right? Enemy controller. Oh, true light. Is that blue eye dragon? Castle of Dragon Soul. Hall of the Haunted. Ring of Destruction. The uncensored version. Champion Vigilance. Azure Eye Silver Dragon. And Blue Eye Spirit Dragon. Right, so this is for the blue eyes um, structure deck. So as you notice, the blue eye focus on synchro, while um, the magician deck features on fusion. Right, there's two of the many mechanism in this game, and then that we have things like ritual, exceeds, um, link summon, right, many many more, pendulum summon. Right, so uh, I think it'll be too overwhelming for new players with all the mechanism, you know, blam, into one deck. So I think they purposely separate it into one that focuses on synchro and one that focuses on fusion. And from there, you can slowly build up to, um, like, one of my deck, we have, like, all the different summoning method in one deck, right? And um, let's take a look at the power pack. Once again, you know, can do that. So we will need to open from the side here. Right. Right, so we start off with oh, Death Trudeau, the Lost Dragons. Reason. Dark Bright. Book of Moon. Oh, Blue Eyes Solid Dragon. Yeah. Forbidden Lands. Alright, so that's for unboxing of the two structure deck. And as you can see that we have like one copy of everything. So Yu-Gi-Oh! is a game with three copies maximum. So to solve this issue, there's two more. Right? So um, since the structure deck contains exactly the same, and unlike other games where you have a high rarity, let's just take out the power-up pack from each of these decks. I believe most of the people will open the deck just for the power pack. Alright, so for the deck, I will try to combine three of them together. For my ancient English deck. Alright, 
so this is the two extra power pack we have for Dark Magician. And first pack we have oh, 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 the Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit. This was one of the first few hand tra hand trap. Next thousand knives. Raigeki. Oh, dark magic attack. Dark renewal. Right, so the next question will be how will they be releasing all the older cards for Asia English so that um we can actually catch up or not really catch up but have a uh, equal footing of when playing against the OCG and TCG. Right, so DD Crow again. Oh, Eye of Tamias. Dark Magic Attack. Skip Good. Oh, King of the Swarm. Right, so that's for the Dark Magician side. Let's take a look at the Blue Eyes White Dragon. Everybody's favorite. Right, if Blue Eye were the one playing Fusion, I believe we will definitely have the Blue Eye Ultimate Dragon, which will need three copies of Blue Eye White Dragon, uh, which is doesn't work since we only have one copy of everything. Actually, makes me really want to try whether you know just one deck by itself, how strong is it? It's not every day you get to play Highlander for. Yu-Gi-Oh! Right, so we have the two packs from the Blue Eye White Dragon. Um, right. Oh! Jackpot! Blue Eye's Alternative Dragon. Black Lotus Moonlight Dragon. Foolish Bureau. Bottomless Trap Hole. Book of Moon. Next. Oh. Dragon Spirit of White. Crack down. Return of the Dragon Lords. And Book of Moon. So that's, that makes three copy of Book of Moon. Alright, so that's all for the unboxing for the Asia English structure decks for Blue Eye White Dragon and also Dark Magician.